Hello and welcome to another Fat Guy Review. My name is Nick and this time I'm finally reviewing Fresh Clean Tees or Fresh Clean Threads now that they have like shorts and other stuff like that. But I've been trying to record this video for like a year. I bought these shirts a year ago but I just haven't gotten around to it but now I'm finally going to be able to do it uh, because this one definitely needs to be reviewed by a fat guy because they're marketing to bigger guys like us. If you watch their ads it says it's going to make you look better, it's going to highlight all the great areas, it's going to be extra long so your little gut doesn't show when you lift your arms. All these claims to make chubby people look a little less chubby, which would be great if it actually works. We're going to find out today. I have in my possession a bunch of fresh clean tees, different styles, from Henleys to V-necks to crewnecks to a sweater. Like, I got all the tees and they're fresh and clean, so I'm going to be able to try these all on. I won't go into every one specifically. First, for reference, here's a regular t-shirt that I got at Target, and let me introduce you to the Fat Cam. Hey, Fat Cam! We're gonna lift our arms up. You can see a little bit of, a little bit of belly there. If you look at the arms, they're fine. It's fine. It's a regular shirt, fits normal, it's good. Let's compare that to a fresh clean tee. If you're ready, I'm ready, let's get naked. So as you can see on the top, it does fit a little bit better and it does make me feel a little bit better. Like it does hug the arms and the cotton of the crewnecks is super soft. Like these are very comfortable shirts. It's a little less, like a little less defined. You can still kind of see all the fatness. Let's lift the arms. Eh, it's a little longer than my last shirt, but no belly sticking out, which is nice. This is a 2X. I wear a 2X. It fits really good for me. This is XL. So it's one size smaller than I normally wear. I was at some point in the, over the last year an extra large, so I bought an extra large. I'm no longer that size, but I thought I'd try it on for reference in case you like shirts a little bit snug. So this is a little more less forgiving, you know? And it's a little shorter. So if you're a 2X, the sizes are pretty true to what they are. 2X, get 2X. I am not liking this fat cam. I love me a good Henley. It makes me feel fancy without actually being fancy. So I love a good Henley. The material on this feels a little bit different, but it's super soft. It just feels a little bit thinner. It hangs really nice. This is a 2XL. It's a little bit bigger than the last one, see? But the length is great, like they say. It's not as good as their crew neck. Their crew neck is definitely the best, most comfortable crew neck I've had. This is the best Henley I've worn just by comfort. And they do kind of compensate for the kind of the gut a little bit, which I appreciate. So there is some difference in sizing, which kind of threw me off when I switched from regular crew necks to the other kind of styles. This is a extra large V-neck, which it feels even smaller than the other extra large. It is definitely shorter too, look at that. So you can see my gut. This is the 2XL V-neck, which feels like it went up three sizes from the XL. This feels like a 3X, but it fits more like the Henley than it does the crew neck. Neither one of these is very comfortable for me, so there's like a weird in-between for the V-necks. And again, the material's not quite as thick and as like comfortable as the crew necks are, so you can tell the crew necks are their bread and butter. Now the last type of shirt I got is another crew neck, but this one has a pocket. How fancy, it's got a little pocket, which I mocked when I bought it, but you know what? This is like the favorite shirt that I have. It's super comfortable. I like the little pocket. I hardly ever use it, but I think it adds a little something to the look of the shirt instead of it just being like a regular t-shirt. I know, it's stupid. It's just a little pocket. And the interesting thing about this is I've worn this shirt for a year now. I've washed it at least 50 times. Does it math that on that, right? And it still feels just like it did when I got it out of the bag. It fits on the arms really nice. It makes me feel confident. It may not look good in the fat game. Let's see. Yeah, see, that's not so bad. But after a year, the collar's still perfect. It holds up really nicely. I will say, I am a huge fan of the Fresh Clean Tee shirts for fat guys. These are the ones I wear the most. They're comfortable, they make me feel good. The advertising was right. It never, it's never right. How is it right this time? I don't know. But uh, if you haven't tried Fresh Clean Tees, I recommend the crew neck. All the other ones are kind of regular, basic, like the V-necks and everything like that. But uh, I definitely love the crew necks for chubby guys. And when it gets cold, they have sweaters now, and I love me a zip up, so I had to get one of these. If I had an avatar for Fat Guy Reviews, it would be wearing a t-shirt with a zip up hoodie on. I live in the Pacific Northwest, so it's always raining or cold, and so this is how I look every day. I think this is probably the best sweater I've ever had to. It's so damn soft and so comfortable. I know they're a little pricey, and every time I see the cart when I'm checking out, I go, Jesus Christ, for four shirts? And then I get them and I wear them. I go, damn, like, these are super comfortable. They're the best shirts I own. They are worth 
the 21 or 22 dollars if you can get them on sale there's usually some sort of discount happening and they don't shrink i hate when i buy a shirt and then i wear it and it's perfect and then i wash it and it's small it fits exactly the same as it did when i bought it so try one and watch how quickly it becomes your favorite t-shirt i hate giving good reviews i don't know this is like the best review i've ever given for anything i'm probably gonna buy their shorts even though i don't wear shorts but i just want to i'm like a fanboy now thank you for watching click subscribe or like or whatever they tell you to do on youtube and i'll be back with more fat guy review stuff let me know in the comments what you would like me to review if you want the opinion of a fat guy on anything Drop it in the comments, and I'll try to review it as quick as I can. Thank you so much for watching. So soft. It's so soft.